today. Sometimes all you get is crickets. This is your Monday Morning Moment where our goal each week is to provide you with a strong, positive message of faith that we hope will help you get your week off to a great start. I got to tell you, it's going to happen. It just is. At some point in your faith journey, you're going to feel like God is silent or God is distant. And I'm, I'm talking not just one or two times. A lot of times you're going to find that. In fact, I have felt that this past week. Now, I've shared with you guys many times that I feel inspired a lot by the Holy Spirit in terms of what to bring you guys here at Intentional Faith for your Monday morning moments or your lives. You know, I wish I could tell you that I'm the one thinking these things up, but I feel inspired. But this past week, crickets. And I can usually tell you a week in advance what I plan on talking about on Monday morning moment. Well, this past week, crickets. What does that mean? Well, here's what I think it means. I think it means that God's trying to get our attention, in this case, my attention. He's trying to remind us, hello, I'm me, don't forget about me. I mean, even God doesn't want to be taken for granted, does he? So I have to share this with you. For the past couple of months, um, you know, and I've been such a proponent of everybody having their daily devotional quiet time with God. For the past couple of months, I haven't had that. I mean, probably three or four months, I just stopped doing my morning devotionals. You know, 20 minutes of time in the, in the very beginning of the day where you just, you block everything out and it's just God. I stopped doing that. I can't tell you why. I just, I just did. You know, sometimes things get a little stale and you just need to pull back a little bit. Well, I think this this week of uh, crickets, God's pretty much saying to me, okay, buddy, hey, time to come on back. Let's, let's get that quiet time. Let's get back together, you and me. And so we can get refocused and re-energized. So here's the message to you. If you ever find yourself in a situation where you feel like, God, where the heck are you, man? You feel so distant and so silent. Okay, it's not God talked about this many times. God's with us always. Jesus is with us always. It's us that needs to get back close to them. So I want to read you a gold nugget that I always refer to. And if you do nothing more than just look and read it, this gold nugget, it'll help you re-engage with the Lord. Are you ready? It comes from Matthew 7, verses 7 and 8. Ask, and it will be given to you. Seek, and you will find. Knock, and the door will be open to you, for everyone who asks receives. The one who seeks finds. And to the one who knocks, the door will be open. Okay, that's coming straight out of our Lord Jesus' mouth. You know what? That's just his advice saying, look, you know, when you need to reconnect, it's, it's on you. Come on back. All right, so what am I going to do? Well, I can tell you, I'm going to start back with my devotionals because I kind of feel like I'm, not, I'm at a position that I miss them. I missed that time. I didn't miss it for a while, and now it's time to get back. So if you ever feel like God is distant, take charge, okay? Reconnect, whether it's through prayer or devotional time or just walks on the beach doesn't make any difference. God is with us always. Never forget. Okay, fans, that's it for this week. And as always, may the Lord of peace himself give you peace at all times in every way. The Lord be with all of you. This week, be the reason somebody else has a great week. Stay strong. Keep the faith. We'll see you right back here next Monday morning.